All right, so the July 2019 best-selling games. What do you think is number one? Let me see what came out that year. Or that month. Titan 2, Dr. Mario World, Sun Ran Kagura Peach Ball, Dragon Quest Builders 2. I didn't even know that came out in the US. Did it come out in the US? The video looks all weird. I can't see a release for it. I haven't been to a, to a GameStop in a while. God Eater 3. Beyond Two Souls, Tetris Effect, Light Drifter, Raiden 5, Fire Emblem Three Houses, I would guess is number 1, Kill a Kill If, maybe number 10, Wolfenstein Youngblood, number not, not, number 6, and let's see if I, what I got right. I was close with Fire Emblem Three Houses. And the other two weren't <laughs> weren't on the list. All right. Uh, the guy from the MPD group. Oh, there were surprises. I mean, NFL is the the NFL is the biggest sport in America. I don't know about the world, but in America, ten ten in the Nielsen ratings. Even with the cleaning sales, Patrick Mahomes just had a phenomenal season. My fantasy football. According to MPD, this is the 20th straight year Madden was number one during its launch month. So, always do that on EA for that. No sales numbers announced. EA shares some insight. It was mainly digital copies, probably because the EA, uh, you have the earlier release if you buy it electronically. They couldn't wait. Unless you got it from a source. Five of the three houses was number two. I wonder if that was a bad move by Nintendo not having it in a non Madden month. The digital sales were not included, so maybe it did beat Madden 20. It was the highest around, highest first month sales for a Fire Emblem game of all time in the US, maybe not in Japan. The Nintendo Direct probably helped with all the cool cinematography and the expansion in the US with a uh, since the DS era, since the Smash era, of Awakening and stuff. I don't know if they showed off all the choices you can make in the game, like Mass Effect. First of all, sales tripled out of the previous record holder. Fire Emblem Echoes, Shadows of Valentia. I didn't even know that did that well. Go figure. No, Awakening is doing well. I like Trails, Fire Emblem Awakening, and Lifetime Sales. That's what my brother said. Rounding out the top. Five biggest sellers for July 2019 were Super Mario Maker 2. Okay, I'm just reading that at that point. More Combat 11 was released in April, sold well again in July, fishing number eight, maybe because of the DLC and stuff. Let me look at the DLC. Two thousand eleven and then eleven. Interesting. Run on Unreal Engine 
and three. Uh, interesting writers. I'm just gonna cover that now, so I can do that review of uh, when I do it for. And do the actual. You gotta see the pro. This is do this one. Kept Samuel Kyo Kittelson was the addition. I don't know the WGA for that, or Zealand of America for that. Pre order bonus online. Night Wolf, Shang Sun, Sindel, and Spawn were in the combat in part two. I know Garrus was a main character, Cedrion, yeah. I don't know if she's really in depth. I'm not saying when the DLC comes out. Exclusive. Mortal Kombat 11 combat pack. Because the Shang Tsung, Spawn, Nightwolf, and Sindel, two more unknown guests. Data miners have uncovered Joker from DC, Terminator, and more combat characters. It'd be interesting if they did like a Dark Fate thing just because it's coming out. Um, a tie in to the new movie Joker for DC. Campbell said he would, he would actually able that would not be in the game. So, Shang Sun will be released June 25th. Night Wolf is August 13th. We should be enjoying for Shang Sun. Alright. So probably let me see if the DLC was factored in. Didn't say in depth why more combat eleven sold that well. It's a hell of a great story, uh another spo warning here just so you know, spoilers alert. Mortal Kombat eleven is a mix of Avengers, Comrade of Zio, etc. Just to make it less a spoiler, I'm not gonna say what exactly it was. Recent comrade, recent toy stuff. Toy spending games was worth $40 million, 34% up. Mainly because of uh, Madden 20. Did not hurt more came out 11 in sales. I don't know if there's camp much cannibalization between Fire Emblem Three Houses and Madden NFL. Maybe there's another football game that would cannibalize. For 2019, total spending games is reached 2.9 million billion. So movies are still way ahead of that by like three or five times the amount, especially Avengers. 
switching PlayStation 4 and, and not Xbox One is seeing sales growth as a big of a bummer for the Xbox One, but maybe they're taking over with the Xbox Game Pass. Nintendo Switch was the highest best selling console of July 2019. Top for months. Doing a lot better than PlayStation 4 and Xbox One. Spending on console has dropped 22% to 169 million. Hardware sales so far down 21%. Probably why the Nintendo Switch has decided to come with new models and price drops. Every console platform has experienced declines in July. Maybe it was a good time to buy once they drop the prices. Only the Switch is growing. PS4 and Xbox One are supposed to be. According to the GameSpot. The same PS4 is an Xbox One is expected to be in the final stages of the life cycles with like Bully 2 and Final Fantasy 7 Remake expected to be above the PS4 and the PS5. Technical analysis. Total game spending on consoles, games, and accessories is around 762 million July 2019. Only slightly up from July 2018. Total spending fell 4% to 6.4 billion on a year to year basis. Maybe because of the Xbox Game Pass, maybe because people are not excited about these games. I have not been buying stuff on eBay. I don't have to count eBay sales. Um, but I haven't been buying, buying as much on eBay. I mainly buy the new games just so I uh, have something to review. Grand Theft Auto 5 still did well. Maybe because of the. The Diamond Casino advertisement. You'll still like Marvel, Marvel Ultimate Alliance 2, Ultimate Alliance 3, uh, Super Mario Maker, System Seller, probably what Switch is doing well, um, Fire Emblem 3 Houses, Super Mario Maker 2, Marvel Ultimate Alliance 3, I believe Minecraft also, Super Smash Ultimate, Mortal Kombat 11, Mortal Kombat Mario Kart 8, there's Zelda Breath of the Wild, yeah, it looks like PS4 has the stuff of this game. I believe Madden NFL 20 was also on Switch. The sales are still good, uh, just not the console sales. Interesting.